Thierry, does this strike a chord then? The man that you knew at Barcelona, I mean, what was he like to work under? Yes, it does. I mean, you said it yourself. We were not allowed to be out uh, during the week after midnight. If we had uh, something to do with our sponsors, uh, we had to tell him. Most of the time he was saying yes, but he wanted to know where we, we were. Not allowed to go and watch a Formula One, not allowed to stay under the sun, no. Not allowed to go and watch uh, a tennis tournament. So those, those are the type of thing that he tries to control. But at the end of the very day, mm. that's just normal stuff. If you want to be a professional player, you play every three games. You have to rest, hit well, and don't go out under the sun or whatever it is. He was controlling everything. But like I said, they were, for me, uh, normal stuff. I'm going oh, okay. to bore some people uh, with, my, with my pep stories. Now, it's, uh, we were top of the league, I think, uh, five points ahead. I think that Sam was on 11 goals or Leo on eight or nine or whatever it was, and I was on three. But we were playing well, uh, scoring a lot of goals. But he wasn't happy with my performance, which is kind of weird because that's, that's Pep. He will have a go at his players and challenge his players when things are going right. When things are not going so right, that's when he's a bit more calm with it. So he texted me, he said, I want to speak to you, Thierry. So obviously I went. And he, has a, he had a DVD of uh, me playing for Arsenal on the table. So I looked at it. He said, do you remember the game? I said, yeah, I remember the game. And he said to me, I want to see those eyes again. And I was like, in my mind, I'm like, with five points ahead, who does that? I mean, I, I was like, happy days. We might win the league. I'm chilling. <laughs> he didn't want me to chill. He didn't want me to chill. He wanted me to be a killer again. Go back to be that killer. Because if Leo doesn't score or, or Sam doesn't score, then you can score. If we can win 10 nil, it's better than three. And therefore, he woke me up. And I know you're going to say, oh, what a great story. But the day after, I scored a hat-trick against Valencia. And wow. we went on and winning the treble. But he will challenge his player all the time. And if you're not ready for it, then it, it, it can hurt. It can hurt because the year after, because we were so balanced, I would say, the year after, he, he took all the strikers. That's another story. And he said to us, if we don't win anything this year, it's because of you. Wow, oh, my goodness. But that's the way it is. If you play for Barcelona and you mm -hmm. have Pep Guardiola, he will demand that of you. He will demand that intensity every day in training. That's just the way it is. If you're not ready to accept that, you have to go.